Hello and welcome to this hotcakes demonstration video. We want to get you started off on, on getting a DNN installed on your on your local installation so that you can do some testing and try out hotcakes. Uh, we do realize that uh, hotcakes does have the dependency on, on having DNN set up, so this is where we're going to start. So an overview, what we're going to look at is just uh, kind of the prerequisites. So you know, what, what do you need in terms of uh, infrastructure or server to get started? And then we're going to do a quick walkthrough on how to install DNN. I'm going to try and keep this as short as possible. Okay. So first, you need to download the most recent version of DNN from dnnsoftware.com. Uh, you need to have a, a setup that has either Windows to the, Windows Server 2008 R2 or higher, um, or if you're you know working on your local development environment, it would be uh, Windows 7 or higher. You need to have a Microsoft SQL Server 2008 R2 or higher, and you need to have the Microsoft Framework .NET 4. Um, one kind of note here, you know, DNN does have a, a cloud hosting setup, so if you want to you know have something set up for them, um, you, you can have them set you up. And, and they'll go ahead and you know turn that on with a, a point click and, and then you can have DNN set up for you automatically. But if you don't have that or, or you wanted to test locally first, this will this will get you through that. Uh, so first, uh, what you want to do is want to download the uh, DNN software, get that set up. Once you get that done, um, then you can you know create the database, unzip the files, and then uh, you know just tell IIS to respond to the URL. Um, you know, it's pretty straightforward. Once you get that done, you just run through a setup wizard, and then you have a working version. So, without too many slides, we're going to jump right into the demo and show you how to do that. So, I'm going to jump over here into VMware. So the first thing we're looking at right here is uh, we're looking at DNN. Uh, we're looking at donanuke.codeplex.com. So, I'm just going to go ahead and download a, a version of 7.0.6. Uh, as well, um, you know, the other thing that we need to download is the latest module package. So you can see here on uh, hotcakescommerce.com, uh, if you just click on the, uh, the the trial page off the home or the the request a trial off the home page, then you'll be able to download it there. Um, I've actually already downloaded these, and so I've got them in my downloads folder. And so here I've got a uh, 706 install right there. And let me just make sure that I've got all these set up. And there's the hotcakes commerce setup. So I'm just going to go ahead and first step is to unzip the zip file. So I'm going to create a, a local local working copy of this. And so I'm going to go, uh, I just have a folder right here. Uh, let's go to put this in my test installs folder. And we're going to call this hotcakes video. And then we're just going to copy all the DNN files over into this. So we're just unzipping all the contents of that zip file into this local copy right here. Um, so while that's doing that, uh, the next step is I need to create a database. And so we're going to create a new database. And just uh, for convention's sake, I'm going to name this hotcakes-video. And I'm going to go ahead and create a login in here. And we'll create a SQL login. Call this hotcakes video. Is that the username? Password of hotcakes video. Then we'll go grant that user access to this. Okay, so now the Hotcakes Video user has access to the Hotcakes Video database. And if we go check over here, we can see that our files are all set up. So let's uh, set up IIS. So in IIS, we're going to create a new website. And we'll call this localhost.hotcakesvideo. <clears throat> Physical path is going to be that folder that we set up. And we'll tell it to respond on localhost.hotcakesvideo. Once we create that, uh, we do need to go make sure that the application pool is set up correctly. So uh, let's go ahead and make this uh, have version 4. So make sure this is running on version 4 of the .NET framework. And uh, just because I have my security set up to use this, I'm going to point it to network service, but that's not a requirement for you. Go ahead and save that. And now I'm going to go ahead and just navigate to that website. So if I go to localhost, 
hotcakes dash video. And while that's starting up, you know, I'll just go ahead and point out the fact that I do have that localhost.hotcakes video entry in my in my host file, and so that's what's making it so that it responds on my local area here. So um, this is showing the community edition setup. Um, we'll go ahead and enter in a password for the host account. And down under database information, I'm going to let it know that I am not using SQL Server Express, but I'm using a SQL database. And so uh, this will be SQL 12. And database name was Hotcakes Video. And I'm going to enter in the user and password of Hotcakes Video. Click Continue. Oh, I need to give that user DBO permission. Sorry about that. Try that again. And now it's installing my database. Getting everything all set up. It's only take a minute or so. All right, so now that that's done, I can go ahead and click Visit Website. That's going to take me straight to the home page of my newly created website. We'll get a nice little pop-up to ask us if we want to read some instructions on how to use DNN. Uh, we'll just go ahead and close that, and, and then we'll have, our, uh, we'll have our site set up. There we go. Now we have our site set up. This is a nice little getting started. Uh, you can use your host password to go in and modify any pages or edit any content on the site. This is all set up here for you. Okay. So as promised, this was very short. Um, I do want to point out that we do have uh, a, a, a number of things coming, you know, as well. So there's a bunch of videos that are that are all coming out. The next video after this is the logical order would be to see the video about installing hotcakes into your installation and using the setup wizard. So, uh, you know, definitely proceed on to those. And then you can see here we also do have an install cheat sheet. If you have any questions, I do want to point out that we do have a, a great community site set up, and this is using uh, DNN Social, Revoke Social. Um, and, and, you know, if you want to come in here, ask questions, uh, suggest features. We we do definitely use this, and we're we're very interested in in your feedback. And you know, actually, we we, we did use this to to create our, our most recent roadmap. So we are we are paying attention to that, and you know, we definitely hope that that you'll uh, th that you'll take advantage of that uh, as well. Uh, you know, if you have any questions or you need support, just go to the support page. And if you have any questions about sales or inquiries, then just go ahead and go to the you know, shoot us an email at sales at hotcakescommerce.com. Thanks.